welcome class prep this is page number 16 and let's read the topic subtracting tens look at this example 5 jump backwards mean minus how many jumps 2 5 minus 2 answer is 3 5 minus 2 answer is 3 right the same way we can do in tens so 10 20 20 this is uh misprinted this shouldn't be 20 again because after 10 it comes 20 then 10 more 30 then 10 more 40 10 uh, more 50 then 10 more 60 so this is counting in tens so when we do backward counting from 50 and then minus 20 we do two jumps because we are doing tens this is not units so 50 minus 20 the answer is 30 So five tens minus three tens is equals to two tens. Five tens is fifty minus three ten is thirty is equals to two ten is twenty. Easy peasy. So fifty minus twenty is equals to thirty. Now let's complete this one. Three take away one. Okay, we can do it by two different methods. Three take away one. Answer is two. Now three again. We will do backward counting to reach one, two, one. So we have to do backward counting after three, uh, and then uh, to reach one, the smaller number, two, one. So how many fingers became two? So the answer is two. The same way we can do thirty minus ten. you we can do either by using number line we can do 30 take away 10 so if we take away just 10 means 110 of minus 110 so the uh, we will land on 20 you can do it this way or we can do it by doing backward counting so 30 we have to reach 10 so we will count backwards from 30 20 10 So I started backward counting from thirty to reach ten. So how many fingers I jumped on, or how many fingers I count to reach ten? Let's do once more. I have to start from thirty backward counting to reach ten. Twenty, ten. I reach ten, and then how many uh, fingers I jump? These are tens now. So two tens is twenty. So Thirty take away ten is twenty. Three take away one is two. Thirty take away ten is twenty. These are units, so these are and these are tens. So they are very similar. Five three take away three. Five on my head. Three on my. Uh, f- uh, sorry, 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 sorry. We are not doing addition. So we have to take away three from five. Three is gone. Another method. See subtraction. We did so many method. Three is gone. Now we will count to reach five. Four, five. So our answer is two. So fifty take away thirty. If five take away three is two. Fifty take away thirty. Just do the same in tens. Fifty take away thirty. Three more jumps. Ten, twenty, and thirty. Yes, the answer is twenty. Or you can do the backward counting. Backward counting. Starting from fifty to reach thirty, forty, thirty, two tens. This is two, two tens. So these fingers are fingers. We can change them to tens whenever we need. So if we are doing tens counting, we will not say one and two. We will say ten and twenty. So our answer is twenty. The rest of the question you have to do with the same method, whatever the method you like. I have told and I have revised uh, two, three different methods. Now question number two, answer these. The first has been done for you, right? So when the sum is written in vertical form, it's easier if we divide them. Like if we write u unit on the left side. In maths, we start from the left side, and t here, tens. So zero take away zero is zero. We know that six take away four. You can do use any. Sorry, six take away two. You can use any method. The answer is four. And we can do it. Read it like this as well. Sixty take away twenty. The answer is forty. The same way you have to uh, do the 
rest of the questions now question number three match each subtraction to the correct answer 50 take away 10 hmm out of these two 50 take away 10 can it be 50 so we will do the backward counting counting starting from 50 backward counting to reach 10 40 30 20 10 we are doing counting in tens so four tens is 40 so this is the answer we i am going to match it like this i would really appreciate if you guys match uh, do the matching with the colored pencils now